even if you no longer receive over the air updates from your carrier, Google is still working to push out bug fixes, security improvements, and new features through its Google Play system update, which was recently renamed the Google System Services updates. These new changes are typically pushed out via app updates through the Google Play Store, but there's a dedicated section for Google Play system updates. And for anyone who needs help finding this spot within the settings app, I'll be sure to link to a dedicated guide down below, since these will need to be installed manually through that system. This week, the Mountain View tech giant is rolling out version 25.42 of the Google Play services application. And right off the bat, we can see that there has been an update to developer APIs to help folks building apps with seamless multi-device experiences, which likely ties into this second entry here that talks about new features for Google and third-party developers to support device connectivity related processes within their apps. Google Wallet is also getting some new features here. So you'll begin to see a new section within the passes area of the application. And from there, you'll be able to send in some feedback to Google and those card issuers. They have also worked on a way for the app to provision a Wavelinks corporate badge and then store that data on the secure element chip within your phone. We have not seen any information about an update to the Google Play Store app. And we're not sure if this means the app will skip a week of updates or if things are just being delayed a bit and we'll see this page updated sometime throughout the week. So please let us know if you end up spotting any details for that specific update. Just don't forget to give this video a like, click on that new hype button that YouTube has been advertising lately, and subscribe to the channel too if you haven't done so already.